Dr. Elizabeth Bergen. I'm an assistant professor at William & Mary, and I'm excited to be here at the Center for Play Therapy Research Spotlight. We did the research with kids in elementary schools from kindergarten through fourth grade who were demonstrating problems with their academic achievement, behavior, or who were demonstrating some depressive symptoms. We used individual child-centered play therapy. The results were really exciting. We found that 16 sessions of child-centered play therapy reduced depressive symptoms among children in multiple critical environments, so parents, children, and in the classroom we saw improvement. Yeah, so depression is a really interesting thing to study with young children because most people conceptualize that depression is something that older people experience because we tend to think about depression from a cognitive framework. But what we know about children is that they uh, experience depressive symptoms across multiple domains of functioning. So not only we, were we surprised to see when we screened for depression how many children were actually experiencing clinically significant depressive symptoms, but we were also really interested to see that their depressive symptoms showed up across multiple critical environments and in multiple domains of functioning. So we saw it in their social, emotional, physical, and um, cognitive behaviors. Center for Play Therapy website.